In this tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to put two images in one um, JPEG file. Um, so basically here I have two files that I pulled up in Photoshop. Um, originally, they were grouped together like this. So I want to try to take um, one off, off the frame. So it's over here. <clears throat> Um, then what I want to do is I want to make sure they're sized the same. So go to image, image size. What I'm looking at here is that they're both 72 resolution and then generally the same size. Um, in this case, I'm going to make the picture taller. So I want the width the same, 800. So I say, okay, and check the size of this one. It's also 72 resolution. 800 pixels by 700 by 600 pixels. So I click OK. So I want to put this below this image. I'm going to go to Image, Canvas Size. So I want to, this is basically where your image is. I want to anchor it to the top so that I'm adding space below it. And then I'm going to double the height approximately. So what I'm basically doing here is I'm keeping it the same width and I'm just making it a lot taller. Click OK. Ta-da! So now you have two options here. You can either, um, and some work for some people and some don't work for some people. <laughs> um, you can take this first tool up here, which is called the Move tool. Click on the one you want to move and drag it over to the space that you just created and let go. Ta-da! You can move this around wherever you want. And then eventually you'll flatten the image to save it. The other option is to use this tool, which is the rectangular marquee tool. And you want to select this area. So I basically clicked down here, dragged it, and released. So this area is selected. You can go to Edit, Copy. So I just made a copy of what was selected. And then I'll go to Edit, Paste. And it sticks it in this image. Before you paste, you want to go to, to this image that you want to move it on. Then again, you want to click the Move tool, and you can move it down. Now here, you know, if I click on the background, I can't move this because it's not selected. Let's see. So you can move the new layer that you've added. This is a new layer that you've added, and you can move that around as you choose. And then you can flatten it. You can also flatten it over here, layer flatten image, and then save as you would normally.